Hello everyone, welcome to Indian School of Physics guys, this is Nitin here and uh, there is this problem, easy problem, nice problem from uh, electrostatics and uh, yesterday night I have framed this uh, problem. So let's read uh, the problem statement. So there are three conducting spheres S1, S2 and S3 you can see and their radius are uh, given as R, 3R and uh, 2R. And uh, the uh, the system of S1 and S2 is placed uh, far away from, uh, you can say, it is placed far away from uh, the sphere 3. Now what is given as, due to some mechanism, only on the sphere S1, a beam of charged particle is incident for time T0. And till, and it is given, we are, uh, uh, you know, uh, this uh, charge beam is incident on a sphere 1, but due to the process of electrostatic induction, uh, the sphere S3 is getting charged and finally its potential is given as V0. Now, this system is connected with the help of a conducting wire here. And it is given incident frequency of charged particle is N0 particles per second. Find T0. Now here, the, uh, this question is uh, pretty easy, uh, pretty straightforward forward and just a com concept application. But some student uh, got confused with the, this part and they thought it is related to photoelectric effect. So guys, please remember here, clearly it is mentioned that N0 particle per second are incident. Uh, so it has, uh, it is some kind of intensity you can say in uh, photoelectric effect and all. But it is nowhere related to that problem. It is simply it simply meaning is we are charging the inner sphere S1 uh, with this rate uh, and charge particle is having charge of Q0. I hope uh, you are able to understand this. So let's discuss this problem. So there is this conducting sphere and uh, this is the electrostatic constant 1 by 4 pi epsilon naught. So what we are doing is uh, as uh, this beam is incident on the sphere S1 uh, let's say due to that process charge of plus q comes on the inner sphere s1 then on the inner surface of s2 minus q will appear and uh, to maintain that uh, potential of 1 and uh, 2 and 3 same some charge will transfer let's say that charge which is coming on this is q2 and charge which is present here is q1 all right so the very first thing we will see in time t naught how much uh, charge is given that is capital q so i can simply write it as per second it is uh, n so n times q into t that is going to be your total charge on the s1 now the next equation we can write as see this system of s2 and s3 is isolated they are not connected with anything else outside right so net charge on this system is going to be zero so i can say this minus q and this plus q1 and this plus q2 that sum also is going to be zero which i have written here and third part, what is given to us, uh, uh, it is given to us that uh, sphere 3 has a uh, potential of V0. That means KQ2 by 2R, this value is given as V0. All right. After this, we can say since they are connected with the help of a conducting wire, so potential of sphere 2 and potential of sphere 3 is going to be same. So I am going to use this fourth equation which is Vs2 equal to Vs3. Vs3 is already known to us and when I write potential at uh, this, you can say due to these two it is going to be 0 here and only due to this it will come. So Kq1 by 3R and this is the value of V0. Once you know this, we can easily say that uh, if I substitute uh, Q1 value and Q2 value from here in this equation, we are going to get the answer for it. So minus Q plus uh, you can say here Q1 plus Q2. So those values when I substitute here, I'm going to get capital Q is equal to phi R V naught by K and capital Q is N Q T naught. So I'll substitute the value here. I'm going to get uh, this T naught, the time for which uh, this beam was incident on sphere one and it is going to be phi R V naught by K N naught Q naught. This is going to be the answer for this problem. So it's a uh, very nice problem, very relevant uh, for J advanced type of exam. Uh, after this, there are many more things uh, which can be related to this, like uh, you can say um, uh, energy analysis, work done analysis, all, all these kind of uh, things can be 
related with this question so next time maybe i'll uh, uh, use the concept of uh, photoelectric effect also and uh, modify this problem a bit so if you have enjoyed this problem please leave a like share this problem with others and i'll be coming up very soon with another problem thank you thanks for watching this